So studio session today, what are we trying to get done? What are we knocking out today? I'm trying to knock out uh, one nice banger. Uh, there's a beat that was sent to me um, by a Nigerian producer named Ritzy. Big up Ritzy. He's very good, very talented and you'll get to see his talent. Um, so he sent me a beat like a couple of weeks ago. So I've just said, let me come down from uni and lay it down. Once I lay it down, get processed and that and you, you guys will hear it. You, I'm sure you guys will love it still. So yeah, it's pro Afro vibes. to do that like, when I hear the beat I try to apply myself and I also give myself like a 30 second rule if I don't get anything in the first 30 seconds I know I'm not trying to go on or jump on the beat because I feel like it's not right for me so it's like when I hear the sound it has to give me a, a sense of feeling and then I just start writing words even if it's not like I will even start with a melody I'll just be talking gibberish but then I apply words after once I know I've got the melody I'll start making it simpler and making it like, make sense to the track so yeah mm. that's how I work what, you just lost your charger? Job team. I'm not happy man right now. You saying that's gonna affect the music? Not even. <laughs> <laughs> just gonna get my check one, two. I'm ready still. Like two hours, two hours mm. max. Like if, if I had a studio session that was two hours, I'd be able to like make something good oh, out no, of it. Yeah, so I'll take two hours. <laughs> SK on the tingle, ha, yeah, yeah. Ha, yeah, yeah. Nothing. I was singing. <laughs> SK on the tingle, ha, yeah, yeah. Ha, yeah, yeah. Ha, yeah, yeah. Yeah, like Maggie and Onga, oh, hey, hey, yeah, yeah. Your love makes me hunger, hey, hey, yeah, 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 yeah. Call me love manga, oh, hey, hey, yeah, yeah, yeah. You say you don't believe me, uh, kill the uh, So literally, when I just heard the beat a couple of weeks back, like I said, and the producer must have said, um, I put Maggie and Onga in it. I was like, oh, what the hell is Maggie and Unger again? I was like, I know what Maggie is, what's Unger? Like, oh yeah, Unger's this. It's like, cool, let's put it in. Send them a voice note, and I was like, oh, Maggie and Unger, oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. And then he was like, rah, this is nice. I said, don't worry, bro, let's go in the studio. I'll put the um, vocals down, and then we'll go go from there. So yeah, this is where we're at. Yeah, um, with writing, I just feel like it's, it's an inbuilt thing. Um, it's natural to me, I feel like. Um, the education side of it helped a lot as well. Like my vocabulary and stuff, things I see, my experience as well. So it was like, whatever I feel, whatever I see, whatever I've been through, I try to put it into the music. And then in a way that is basically relatable to people that are listening to it as well. Say you don't believe me. Back brain, yeah, yeah, let me be your best friend. Mm. Back brain, yeah, yeah, forget what people say, baby. Back brain, yeah, yeah, let me be your best friend. Oh shit. Back brain, yeah, yeah, let, uh, let's go again. Yeah, yeah, let me be your best friend. Mm. Back brain, yeah, yeah, forget what people say, baby. Back brain, yeah, yeah, let me be your best friend. Back brain, yeah, yeah. Fuck. Let's go again. Back brain, yeah, yeah, let me be your best friend. Back brain, yeah, yeah, forget what people say, baby. Back brain, yeah, yeah, let me be your best friend. Mm. Back brain, yeah, yeah, forget what people say, baby. I'll take a bow, son. I mean that, take a bow. Uh, 
like do your feelings like how you're feeling during the day does that affect your music what you've written that day or like yeah, sometimes you've had a bad day or you've had a good day thousand percent um when was it last year just a couple like months ago we went to a hall party and it was a thing where like i was with my brother Nima and i was with my brother Femmes as well and there was a certain situation that went on we came back to the studio and i laid something about it like, straight away it, so yeah literally it's, up, it's about my experience literally that like, as long as it's, it's real, then I feel like I connect, can connect to it, innit? Mm, so everything that you lay down on the track's like... It's real, it's 100% real. real, and it's been built, felt like, from within, innit? It's real stuff, like, mm. it's not made up, nothing like that. Yeah, yeah, people say, yeah, yeah. It's too high. <coughs> Let's go again. Let me get our water. Again. <coughs> Back way, yeah, yeah. Best friend, do. Back way, yeah, yeah. Literally, I've done the chorus now. Uh, laid down the chorus. I'm gonna put the verse in soon. In like a couple of minutes, but we'll just go on with the vibe still. Sounding nice. Watch out. I like my girl Slim Tendow. One that go wish me better. Let's go again. My girl Slim Tendow. Sounds mad. My girl slim. Sorry, need a strong entrance. I like my girl slim tender. Oh. One that go wish me better. Oh. Cause ah, let's go again. I like my girl slim tender. Oh. One that go wish me better. Oh. One that go. I'm trying. My girl slim tender. One that go wish me better. Oh. Please don't change like the weather. English weather. Oh. You're gonna repeat this part twice, yeah? Yeah. I like the vibe, it's catchy. Let's go. One that go wish me better. Please don't change like the weather. English weather. I'm still, like, even with my song, I'm still trying to push it, like, there. Wherever I go, I'm trying to make people know about my sound, like, mm. and my tunes and that. I want, I want you to know what I'm on, kind of thing, do you know what I mean? When, when, when people think of SK, I want them to think of, like, love. Like world love, like through music. Like whenever I want when like you mention my name and you hear a song, it's like yeah. When you hear a song, you have a, a sense of love. You just want to show love to another person, that like, kind of thing. Doesn't have to be between a boy and a girl. It can be between like brothers and that. Like with Mr. Man, that's what I try to do as well with that. And it's just a thing of like I want everyone to just feel me on a worldwide level, kind of thing. Not just trying to stay ahead. Like, you know what I mean?